friends, Merry Christmas. Thank you so much for spending a part of your Christmas holidays with me. If you're watching this on Christmas day, if not, that's okay. You can watch this video anytime, but we're here today for another vlogmas video, another book challenge. And it is such a pleasure to showcase someone's bookshelf. So I told you I had asked people, I'd asked my viewers, I'd asked my friends on Instagram to send me pictures of their bookshelf. And today's book challenge is going to be a little bit more voyeuristic than usual because Katrina Sims, a friend of mine on Instagram, sent me a picture of her bookshelf, her entire bookshelf. And so zooming in, it's not always possible to read all the titles of the books. So we're just going to kind of wing it. We're going to see how many of the books on the shelf we can actually read their titles. And I'll tell you how many of these books I've read and you will tell me how many of the books you've read and we'll compare notes and we'll see which of these books we want to read more. So <laughs> thank you so much, Katrina, for sending us this picture of your bookshelf. It's a beautiful bookshelf. It's also really inspiring to see some of the titles that are here. And I hope you'll all play along with me as we look what's on the shelf. We look at other people's bookshelves and we see how many of the books we've read let's chat about that in the comments but before we start perusing this bookshelf it is a vlogmas so we must sing even though vlogmas is almost over we're still gonna sing <laughs> we're making a book list and checking it twice we're gonna find out who's been naughty or nice book lists are coming to town it's book lists vlogmas style Hi friends, thank you so much for sticking around. Thank you for watching these videos with me. Thank you for 25 days of Vlogmas challenges. So we're going to go through Katrina's bookshelf and I'm just so happy to be showing Katrina's bookshelf because it is gorgeous. So we're gonna start with one book on the top and that is Well Read Black Girl by Glory Eden, which I read and highly recommend if you haven't yet read it. So check that book out on the first shelf. We start with Becoming by Michelle Obama, which I still have not read. Next is The Audacity of Hope by Barack Obama, which I have read. New Daughters of Africa, the collection by Margaret Busby, I have not read. Then is a book by Joyce Carol Oates. And did I mention that we couldn't make out all the titles of all the books on this shelf? So give yourself a point. If you've read any of Joyce Carol Oates books, I have not read anything by her, so I don't get a point there. They Were Her Property by Stephanie Jones, I have not read. Wandering in Strange Lands by Morgan Jerkin, I have not read. Grown by Tiffany Jackson, I have not read. On Black Sister Street by Chika Unigwe, I have not read. Ring Shot by P. Jelly Clark, I have not read. Florine Sky by Mahogany L. Brown, I have not read. When Life Gives You Mangoes by Kareen Getton, I have read. One Day My Soldiers Opened Up by Anne Lavanzant, I have not read. A Mercy by Toni Morrison, I have not read. Paradise by Toni Morrison, I have not read. Song of Solomon, I have not read. Tar Baby, I have not read. I did read The Bluest Eye and Sula. The Color Purple by Alice Walker, I have read. My Sister the Serial Killer by Oinkan Brathwaite, I have read. The Harlem Renaissance Reader, I have not read. Hair Story by Ayanna Bird, I have not read. Tender-Headed Essay Collection, edited by Pamela Johnson, I have not read. Twisted by Emma Dabiri, I have not read. Black Imagination by Natasha Marin, I have not read. The Rose That Grew From Concrete by Tupac Shakur, I have not read. I've read some of his poems, but I haven't read this entire work. The Sweeter the Juice by Shirley Taylor Hazlip, I have not read. Shih Tzu for Dummies, I have not read. Roots by Alex Haley, I have read. The Bible, I have read. How to Say It, I have not read. The Baking Book, I have not read. On the next shelf, we start with The Water Dancer by ta Coates, I have read. Memorial by Brian Washington, I have not read. The Girl in the Mirror by Rose Carlisle, I have not read. Such a Fun Age by Kylie Reed, I have read. Silver Sparrow by Tayari Jones, I have read. Till the Well Runs Dry by Lauren Francis Sharma, I have not read. The Beauty is Breaking by Michelle Harper, I have not read. Full Disclosure by Cameron Garrett, I have not read. This Time Next Year by Sophie Cousins, I have not read. Eternal Life by Dara Horn, I have not read. Leaving Before the Rains Come by Alexandra Fuller, I have not read. Dance, I couldn't make out that author, but I haven't read this book for sure. Him by Matt Johnson, I have not read. Mm. 
Book of the Little Axe by Lauren Francis Sharma, I have not read. Blue Tights, I have not read. Home Before Dark by Raleigh Sager, I have not read. A Girl is a Body of Water by Jennifer Nansubuga McCombie, I have not read. In a Holidays by Christina Loren, I have not read. Gods of Jade and Shadow, I have not read. A Woman is No Man by Ita Fromm, I did read this. The Mothers by Britt Bennett, I have not read. Brown Girl Dreaming by Jacqueline Woodson, I have read. One of the Good Ones by the Mulite sisters, Micah and Maritza Mulite, I have read. Hitting a Straight Lick with a Crooked Stick by Zora Neale Hurston, I have not read. Remembrance by Rita Woods, I have not read. Dear Haiti, Love Elaine by the Mulite sisters, Maritza Mulite and Micah Mulite, I have not read. On the third shelf, we start with The Black Bottom Saints by Alice Randall, I have not read. The Death of Vivek Oji by Akweka Emezi, I have not read. The Last Store of Mina Lee by Nancy Jun Young Kim, I have not read. Luster by Raven Lalani, I have read. Stop Telling Women to Smile, I have not read. Aftershocks by Nadia Uwusu, I have not read. Lakewood by Megan Goodings, I have not read. Trading Dreams at Midnight by Diane McKinney Whetstone, I have not read. Girl, Girl, Girl by Kenya Hunt, I have not read. The House of Deep Water by Jenny McFarland, I have not read. A Burning by Mega Majumdar, I have not read. It was on my TBR this month. I'm not sure if I'm going to get to it. The Office of Historical Corrections by Daniel Evans, I have not read. The Rules of Magic by Alice Hoffman, I have not read. I Am Malala by Malala Yousafzai, I have read. A Tale for the Time Being by Ruth Ozeki is one of my favorite books. I have read it. I love seeing it on other people's bookshelves. Hood Feminism by Mickey Kendall, I have not read. Severance by Ling Ma, I have not read. The Vanishing Half by Britt Bennett, I have read. Transcendent Kingdom by Ya Jesse, I have read. His Only Wife by Peace Adzomedzi, I have not read. The Two Lives of Lydia Bird by Josie Silver, I have not read. The Awakening of Malcolm X by Ilyasa Shabazz and Tiffany G. Jackson, I have not read. Red at the Bone by Jacqueline Woodson, I have read. A Taste of Sugar by Mary Silvera, I have read. The House at Sugar Beach by Helen Cooper, I have not read. A Song Below Water by Bethany C. Morrow, I have not read. Land of Love and Drowning by Tiffany Yannick, I have read. Color Me In by Natasha Diaz, I have not read. The Prophets by Robert Jones Jr., I have not read. Happy and You Know It by Laura Hankin, I have not read. On the next shelf, we start with The Devil in Silver by Victor Laval, I have not read. The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue by V.E. Schwab, I have not read. The Institute by Stephen King, I have not read. Under the Dome by Stephen King, I have not read. Legendborn, I have not read. I couldn't make out that title. The Blackbirds by Eric Jerome Dickey, I have not read. Black Book, I have not read. The Promised Land by Barack Obama, I have read. That was the first book that I read in 2021. Cast by Isabel Wilkerson, I have read. The Dreamers by Karen Thompson Walker, I have not read. How to Be an Anti-Racist by Ibram X. Kendi, I have read. A Dream So Dark by L.L. L. McKinney, I have not read. The Bible, again, I have read. Someone Knows My Name by Lawrence Hill, I have not read. This Bitter Earth by Bernice L. McFadden, I have not read. Space Between Worlds, I have not read. Magic Lessons by Alice Hoffman, I have not read. And then we have some titles that I couldn't make out, so we're going to skip the ones that I can't make out, that's fine. <laughs> Tall History of Sugar by Cordella Forbes, I received a copy from the publishers a few weeks ago, I haven't yet read it. The Help by Catherine Socket, I have not read. On the bottom shelf, there are only a few titles that I could make out. I'll share those with you and you'll get a point if you get them. But we're going to count these as bonus. So we're going to stop at the fourth shelf. And anything on the fifth shelf, if you've read it as a bonus, if you haven't read it, then it doesn't count against your score. So on the bottom shelf, I see Crazy Rich Asians by Kevin Kwan, which I have read. Just Mercy by Brian Stevenson, which I have not read. The Toni Morrison essay collection, which I started reading but never finished, so no for me. Time Outside by Stacey Abrams, which I have not read. I Really Needed This Today by Hoda Kotb, who is a presenter on the Today Show on NBC. I have not read her book. Little Fires Everywhere by Celeste Ng, which I have read. 
Sister Outsider by Audre Lorde, I have not read. And Frank Plantin by Zalika Reed Bento, I have not read. That was 103 titles from the first to the fourth shelf. I read 25 of those. Plus any book that you could make out on the bottom shelf is a bonus. Two of the books that I could make out on the bottom shelf I had read, so I get two bonus points there. So I have 27 out of 103. Would love to know your score down below. Give yourself a bonus point for any book that you could make out that I didn't call the title and add that, whether it's on the bottom shelf or any of the shelves that we mentioned before. Thank you so much, Katrina, for sending us a picture of your bookshelf and allowing us to do this special extended video for Christmas. So thank you so much to Katrina. Thank you for all of you who watched. Thank you so much for playing along with me and for letting me know your score down below. I love playing this game, love comparing how many books we've read. And so we'll continue. Looking forward to another video tomorrow. I hope you'll be here to join me for it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And let's chat down there. And until next time, Merry Christmas and happy reading. Bye.